What's going on guys? Welcome to Gregel's TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you're subscribed so you know what's going on in the world of tech. Let's jump right into it. The first story of the day, and these are some big stories we got today, is about the Galaxy Note 7 and the reason for the fires and explosions. Now Samsung this hasn't released their official announcement on this until either the end of this month or in January at the latest, so we should know officially from Samsung, but another company which is an engineering firm firm called Instrumental did their own internal testing on this and they came back with some interesting results. And the reason isn't specifically to do with the battery, the battery is involved. The reason for the fire is because of the aggressive internal design that Samsung did with this phone. This phone is very thin, it's got a lot of components inside and what happens is everything, even during normal usage, what happens is the phone components will basically push up against the battery the battery does like almost like a jelly donut thing. I don't know if you've ever had a jelly donut. I don't know about other countries if you guys eat jelly donuts, but here in America, if you squeeze a jelly donut, it'll ooze out. So what ends up happening is all those internal components would kind of together and then the battery would basically uh, leak and then cause a fire. Now this makes total sense because as new phones come out, everybody was always like, oh, we have the slimmest phone and better battery life and all this other crazy junk. And what happened is you put this giant battery into such a slim design with tons of components and it's just there to cause damage. It's hopefully, I, I don't mind a bigger phone. I mean, you, everyone puts cases on their phones already anyway, or at least 90% of the people do. So why not just make the phones a little bit bigger don't scram it, don't cram it all in there together and uh, put a giant size battery in there still. I, I definitely want a giant size battery because I want all day battery life and I'm talking 24 hours of battery life and uh, do it that way. I, I don't know why they try to make these phones so thin, but very interesting. I love what Instrumental did here because it gives us another look at possibly the real reason behind the Note 7 explosions. Next up, if you have the Pixel phone or Pixel tablet, I'm talking Pixel XL, Pixel phone or the just regular Pixel tablet, you are in for some good news today. Android 7.1.1 came out. I am in the process of actually updating my phone, but it is officially out. It killed a bunch of bugs. And one of the cool things that also came up with, it, actually two things, was like I was talking a couple weeks ago, double tap to turn on your screen and also lift to wake so you can see the screen. So those are two awesome updates from Google that have been just released today in 7.1.1. Some of the fixes that this update put in place were customers couldn't retrieve their visual voicemail messages and were getting an error 9999. In some areas, visual voicemail icon notification was not displaying when a new voicemail message was received. Device stopped playing voicemail messages over Bluetooth after the screen timed out. Device occasionally went to blue screen during inbound call. Email font was too small, so increase it. Text was garbled on the call screen dialer and the text was corrupted on the recent calls and contact list screens. This update also put in the choice of choosing either cellular or Wi-Fi for your preferred calling while roaming internationally and the latest Android security patches. Guys, that's the news for today. Appreciate you watching and listening to me while I spout the news out. Make sure you subscribe because this I do this every single day. Also, guys, the question of the day is what are you getting your mom for Christmas? Let me know in the comments down below. Also, my product of the day is the Google Pixel phone. Pick this thing up or at least check it out okay check out the stats the, the specs everything about this phone it's a dope phone i'm not joking i'm not lying check it out thanks for watching guys i'll see you down the road peace